What's the goddamn deal? You know what I mean? What's going on? Oh, man, I've been feeling a lot of beta male bitch-ass energy, man. You know what I mean? I gotta address some shit, you know? Uh, but first, we reserve our United States constitutional rights, freedom of speech, and everything that rides with that. The title of this video is called, That's, That's My Baby Mama. That's My Baby Mama. For all you, but let me get in, let me get a disclaimer. If you don't want our services, go pick up a goddamn book and read it, all right? Furthermore, uh, let me give a shout out to all the sham stoppers clan that's been down, you know what I mean? Hey man, hold your head up high. Hold your nuts and say, I will not bow down to no once a month bleeding bitch. Okay? Alright? Let's get it on. Let's have us some fun on this this my baby mama ass type niggas. And we all got them. We all got them as homeboys, right? Huh? Right? Here we go. These your homeboys. And I'm talking about the homeboy. I don't mind paying child support. That's my child's mom. Nigga, let me tell you something. When she put you on child support, fucking idiot, you ain't fucking friends no more. That, that, that's my child's mama. That ain't nothing but a bunch of drama, okay? And I'm going to tell you something. Her sending armed men to your house to make you pay for her being irresponsible nigga you a fucking idiot I'm talking to the bitch niggas you guys can point the finger at him you, you can talk about the vacation and if you do that it's really unfair it's really unfair it's my team my quarterback and if you guys do that man it's unfair we lost as a team we lost as a team man it could be real frustrating your thoughts Steve? I, I, I love it T.O. has always been passionate he always wore his uh, emotions on his sleeve but yet and still this <laughs> look at the old man in front of this nigga man <laughs> You know what I mean? It's about to tell my baby mama. It's about to tell my baby mama. Man, you better get out of that bitch shit. Grown ass men talking about that's they baby mama. Nigga, she ain't your friend, nigga. Okay? She is not your friend. How many niggas remember the Battle of the Alamo? Okay? It ain't the Battle of the Alamo anymore. It's the Battle of Alimony, nigga. Huh? It's the Battle of Alimony. And what does that transpire from? A fucking sheet of paper, nigga. So, all you agency niggas. It's the agency. You trying to sue the agency? Okay. The government shut down, dumb motherfuckers. Why child support ain't shut down? They still sending you them notices, ain't they? Well, the goddamn shit ain't shut down, motherfucker. Shut that bitch down. You don't have to worry about child support because I have proof that it's her shit. We are the only ones can get your ass off of child support. Real talk. Shit. That's my baby mama. Will you tell a new nigga to pay her fucking way through society? Okay? I'm going to come out of Bible verse. You ever heard of Abraham? 
Huh? Abraham chose his son's virgin woman. He chose his son to have a woman that's clean. You know what I mean? Real talk. See that? Hold on, let me pull this back. Let me go to the verse. Check this out. Behold, here I stand by the well of the water, and the daughters of the men of the city are coming out to, dry, to draw water. Now let it be that the young woman to whom I say, please, let down your pitcher that I may drink. And she says, drink, and I will also give your camels a drink. Let her be one, be the one you have appointed for your servant, Isaac. And by this, I will know that you have shown kindness to my master. You see that? Rebecca, man. Rebecca was a faithful woman. Just because a bitch named out here named Rebecca don't mean she, she a virgin. Rebecca was a virgin. You see that shit? And it happened before he had finished speaking that behold, Rebecca, who was born to Bethuel, son of Malachi, the wife of Nahor, Abraham's brother, came out with her pitcher on her shoulder. Nigga, and she carrying the shit on the shoulder, so she carrying her weight. Child support is your baby's mama's weight that she not carrying. But she wants you to carry the weight, which is called support. Support means to carry the weight. She wants you to carry her weight. Now, the young woman was very beautiful to behold, a virgin. Pussy ain't been penetrated or nothing. Ain't been broke out. It ain't been popped. That cherry ain't been popped. No man had known her. And she went down to the well, filled her pitcher, and came up. And the servant ran to meet her and said, Please let me drink a little water from your pitcher. So she said, Drink, my lord. That's what y'all need to start having these bitches calling you lord. My lord. Then she quickly let her pitcher down to her hand and gave him a drink. You see that? And when she had finished giving him a drink, she said, I will draw water for your camels also until they have finished drinking. What's up, man? Huh? You see that? Look at that. Then she quickly emptied her pitcher into the troll, ran back to the well to draw water and drew for all his camels. Look at that shit. And the man wondering at her remained silent so as to know whether the Lord had made his journey prosperous or not. You see that? They were just staring there, staring at her like, damn, I need me an obedient broad. You know what I mean? Your baby mama disobedient. She gonna send our man to your house and you a goddamn fool talking about that's my baby mama, that's my child mom. You go to jail. That's my child mom, that's my baby mama. Get out of here with that old pussy ass shit, nigga. That's pussy shit. Stop being motherfucking pussies out here. Stop letting these bitches run you. Stop letting these bitches wearing pants all the motherfucking time. Let me tell you some stories when I grew up, goddammit. Let me tell you something. My dad had a homeboy. He had a wife. And he had children. So it was me and my sister. And then his homeboy had one son and three girls. All right? This is a true story. All right? True story. Now, we couldn't be around the grown folks. They already said, hey, y'all go play, right? But we were supposed to be separated. Ain't nobody separate us. So we went back there and played. They ain't think nothing of it. So 
I seen the little one of his little girls that looked it. She stood out from the other two. You know what I mean? So we was just playing. I was just flirting with her. You know, I still remember this when I was little. And my sister was talking to the dude. You know what I mean? So my sister and that dude went, they went off somewhere under the covers or something. And I took the old girl in the closet. So we was in the closet hunching and shit. You know what I mean? Real talk, hunching. When I was in, when I went to motherfucking kindergarten, girls used to have me put their hand down they little cootie cat. And I had to see they had grits down there. They ain't had no grits. Real talk. When I went to private school, the left side of the hallway was for the girls, lockers. And the right side was for the boys' lockers. Real talk. Real fucking talk. This shit is out of order. Talking about, there's my baby mama. She don't care nothing about you. She care about making you the motherfucking slave. We the only channel that talk about these bitches. These other niggas is bitch-ass niggas. Scary. Call the police ass niggas. You know what I mean? I don't call the police on nobody. Real talk. I will make you call the police on me though. Now that bitch is your enemy when she call the laws on you. You remember that. Because them laws will kill so many people. I'm not a cop and I'm playing devil, devil's advocate on this motherfucker. You know what I mean? Not going to do that. Make that bitch be responsible. Pay her own motherfucking way through society. You got Oprah out here. You got Beyonce. You got all these successful women. What's your goddamn baby mama's problem? Huh? Huh? Yeah, I'm just going to talk some shit. I don't feel like doing no more education shit right now. I'm fucking pissed. Fuck these hoes. It ain't about no fucking children. Yeah, y'all been hearing what's going on? The food stamp uh, uh box? The food stamp box. They making these bitches get food stamp boxes. Making these bitches eat nutritious. Baby mama put you on child support because her diet bad. Bitch don't eat right. I always want to eat meat, steak, lobster, and shrimp and shit. Get the fuck out of here. Know what I mean? And my baby mama. Nigga, fuck that. Let me play you niggas one more game. You guys can point the finger at him. You, you can talk about the vacation. And if you do that, it's really unfair. It's really unfair. It's my team. It's my quarterback. And if you guys do that, man, it's unfair. We lost as a team. Don't leave it there. I ain't seen no tears or nothing. That's the worst acting job. But that's how you niggas it be out here like that. And then when you go in the court, y'all let a lawyer bitch change your fucking mind like a little hoe. wrong with y'all, man. Should not... You watch these goddamn videos, over a thousand videos, not one of you motherfuckers supposed to be on child support. Shit. Not one of you. Hold on, I'm gonna pull up another book. I'm gonna put something in your face. Put something in your fucking... Face. Okay? 
Let's see, 545. One more again. Did I did I check mark that bitch? Huh? Didn't I show y'all this shit long time ago? Huh? Then we show you that shit? Hmm? What's wrong with y'all? Hmm? Don't nobody call my phone with no bullshit. See that? Don't nobody call my phone with no bullshit. See this shit? A slave over a slave, a master over a master. Where your manhood at, man? Huh? Y'all gonna let a bitch control y'all? Tell you you gotta get out of here? Huh? See that shit? Male, female. Master, slave. Male, female. Master, slave. I'm gonna tell y'all something. Over here, I ain't gotta sweet talk a bitch. Tell her this and tell her what she wanna hear. A bitch wanna be here because a bitch wanna be with the strongest man, nature. She wanna be, a woman gonna be with you if she feels safe and protected. And the reason why she done pulled this shit on niggas, she pulled this child support shit on weak ass niggas. Right? Right? Or she'll pull the shit on because she think the state got more power than you do. No, fools. You got more power than the state, fools. Real talk. And my baby mama, and my baby mama. Dude, this channel used to be so pumping. I got all rid of all these pussies and shit. I'm so fucking happy. I am so fucking happy. I got rid of so many niggas that complain and all that shit. I'm so fucking, it feels so fucking good. And I still got the ones that been down since day one. That he, who ain't go nowhere. Who ain't dick hopping. And the niggas that did all that shit, they ass is still paying child support. <laughs> you know what I mean? Being a bitch. Just bitch, bitch shit. Right here on this screen, bitch shit. And you got Deion Sanders making fun of that nigga on the cool. Watch. We lost to the team, man. Look, it be real frustrating. Your thoughts, Steve? I, I, I love it. T.O.'s always been passionate. He always worked. And you and your baby mama supposed to have been a team, right? Man, y'all better wake the fuck up. Government ain't no, ain't no fucking government shut down. Nigga, please. If the government will shut down, goddamn child support agencies will be shut down since they are so-called arm of the state, huh? Man, get the fuck out of here, dumbass niggas on YouTube. Better not call my goddamn phone. Bet fucking not. This the greatest channel on YouTube where we cuss a bitch out. 
We'll tell a lawyer bitch to suck our dick and a bitch who thinks she got power at the, co the crowd roll up there at the pulpit need to suck some dick too. Now, play this motherfucker. Play this motherfucker somewhere. And if they don't like it, have them call me. Fuck them. Peace.